Hello, all you security fanatics. It's Jack Wallen again to help you get things done. Let's find out how to encrypt files from the Linux command line with the 7-Zip app. To install the package that includes the encryption features, log into your Linux machine, open a terminal window, and issue the command sudo apt-get install p7-zip-full-y. Let's say you have the file web servers, which contains important information about the web servers in your data center. To encrypt that file with 7-zip, issue the command 7-za-p-mx equals 9-mhe-t7z webservers.7z webservers. You will be prompted to create a passphrase for the encryption. Once you've done that, the new encrypted file webservers.7z is created. You can also encrypt multiple files. Say you have the files web servers and Kubernetes to be encrypted into the file data.7z. The command for this would be 7za-p-mx equals 9-mhe-t7z data.7z web servers Kubernetes. Once you've encrypted the files, you should then delete the originals with the command rm web servers kubernetes. Those files wouldn't be of any use if you couldn't decrypt them. So how do you do that? We have the files data.7z and webservers.7z. With 7z, file decryption is done like so. 7za e data.7z or 7za e webservers.7z. In either instance, you'll be asked for the passphrase you created during the encryption process. If you failed to delete the original files, which you shouldn't neglect to do, 7z will ask if you want to overwrite the existing files. In our examples, that would be web servers and Kubernetes. Once you've decrypted the files, you can then view their contents. If you want to learn more in the ways of everything tech, be sure to subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel and watch more how-to videos at How to Make Tech Work.